From traditional roots, commercial shrimp farming now transforms coastal habitats into wastelands. Farmed for centuries in Asia, it has changed from a small-scale business into a global industry. Commercial shrimp farming began in the 1970s. Fishermen in Asia realised that more money lay in this booming business than other fishing. The shift was sudden. Asia now accounts for 75% of the industry and Thailand is its largest exporting nation. The shrimp are regularly dosed with antibiotics to combat the spread of disease from intense crowding and filthy water. As many as 13 pesticides are dumped into a typical pond. The waste is discharged into the surrounding environment, upsetting the ecological balance, while the chemicals and antibiotics inevitably find their way up the food chain. But it's the scale of the devastation caused that is staggering. As this largely unregulated business boomed, vast areas of tropical coastline were transformed and whole mangrove forests cleared. Once the mangroves are ripped out, the coastline is faced with erosion, coral reefs are endangered and habitats are eliminated. So much waste is built up in the farms that the farmers must abandon them after only three to five years. The soil is unusable for anything else. The water is polluted. And once fertile ecosystems are left ravaged, it can take as much as 30 years for the land to recover. A risk to coastal ecologies and their communities.